Sports talk. Sports talk. Sports talk, everyone. Sports talk 101. How you feel about um the Mar the Rose of Kawhi Leonard? Toronto had to do what they had to do, bro. He was fit. Like what has he done the last eight years? Like playoff what? Playoff what? Fit? To me. Man. This is a business, bro. If you not getting past even if it's LeBron, eight years? You got swept 4-0? Oh, no. Niggas got to make some adjustments, bro. Um, I disagree with the He's feed. Feed in the offs? Agree with that. He hasn't really... His what potential is, doesn't come out in the playoffs. What has he done? He's going into his what? His 10th year? Ninth year. He probably like a six-time All-Star. Ninth year? I don't care about none of that, bro. No, All-Stars don't matter. I'm getting swept? That's he's just playing against LeBron, though. Listen, bro. You are a grown man at the end of the day. LeBron is LeBron, though. Absolutely. 110%. He's different. You're getting swept 4 0. Looking like you lost in the playoffs, bro. What it was like 23% from the field goal? I mean, this last this last year, when it, it was really bad. I'm not going to lie. Bro, they was the first seed. I mean, the Toronto organization did bad. They fired the head coach. How do you feel personally about Kawhi, actually? Just, what do you think about him? Good player? Great player? I like okay, Kawhi. Bro. I like Kawhi, but I hope he's the same after this injury. Because okay. remember, he was definitely up 20 against Golden State for that bum ass nigga. Big What's fact. his name? Zaza Pachula. He yeah, did that that's sneaky shit. injury. Facts. You know what I mean? It was definitely up 20. You know, Kawhi, yeah. real humble, quiet that's assassin. A real, that's you know what I'm saying? So, I can't call it, but it seems like he really wanted to go to LA. Mm -hmm. He might still yeah. want to. You know, but, you know, I ain't mad at him. It was a trade. He got no choice. You think? I think he gonna, he gonna get busy just to. I think he wants a shoe deal. He stayed. Oh, you think he wants a shoe deal? I think that's what it's about. He wants a shoe deal. He wants money now. Before he wasn't really into the money, and maybe the Spurs organization was like a. That shit seemed like it's real discipline over there. He was mm -hmm. probably tired of that shit. Lucas, I don't think he wants Brad. I'm gonna tell you for the simple fact. Do I Brad don't matter in my opinion? Because um, he gave up 80 mil. As soon as he asks for a trade, as soon as he wants to be traded, right. he loses the ability to get a max deal. So, I mean, he left 80 mil on the table. That was 220, right? It was over. Yeah, um, I don't even think the Spurs would have um, offered them what it was, but it could have been something like that around then. So, I don't think it's about the money. I don't know what it is about, because he's, he's weird. Like, he's quiet. Very mad quiet. Doesn't really express himself. So, I don't know what it is with him. I hope. Uh, I mean, maybe he wanted to just go to L.A. Is he from L.A.? Help me out there. I, I think he's from L.A., if I'm not mistaken. I don't want to say something. So if he's from L.A., I guess I understand it, but... Does he want to play with LeBron? I hope not. Like, I hope that's not what he wants what? to play. Cause Why is LeBron this? What? No, that's fire. What's the problem? That's fire, but, like, he played LeBron in the, in the finals, I believe. You feel me? He locked him up a couple times. He played Lock great, him up. great defense Lock, with LeBron James. Locked him up. Like, I don't want to see them together. I, I want to see Kawhi, you know, by himself. He's good. He, he did it by himself already. Who's being the Warriors if it's no Nobody's form ever going to beat the Warriors. If it's bro. no form of team up, like, what are we doing? They just added the Marcus yeah, Cousins. Marcus Cousins. What about that addition? I like the guy. You know, I like the guy. He's a bully. Bully. You know. Talented at that size. You think he's coming back from that injury? The same. Nobody comes back from that injury the same. Only like Kobe, I see him do it. Everybody else just changes their career differently. You know, Brandon Jennings. Um, can't think of somebody else that might happen. If I just stick with Brandon Jennings, Brandon Jennings was dropping 55 before. Facts. Before that happened. And then now he's, they sign him late season, minimum better every oh year. Oh my God. He's playing I mean, overseas. He's doing all types of weird shit. The way DeMarcus Cousins injured himself was terrible. Was so Sophie. Because I think it was like, what, two minutes left on the clock? Mm -hmm. He did some extra shit when he shouldn't even probably been in the game at that point. And he just went down. Like, I think he hurt himself. Like, it wasn't even like a clash or anything like that. He got a chance. Marcus got a chance because, um, he, like, he don't really, in my opinion, he don't really do nothing. Like, his game is not athletic. It's more of like a skilled game. He's a big, he's a big skilled guy. Feel me? Like, he, Big guy who could put it on the floor, he could shoot. So he's a, it's not like he's gonna really like beat you with quickness or his jumps real high. Solid fifteen. A game? This that's what you see? I'm asking you. Oh um, your opinion. This year? This year. When he plays? I think even fifteen is hard to average on that team, man. So solid ten is great for him. Twelve. 
twelve. I'm hoping, but even that's like it's, they so stacked. Feel me? Like he might not play. He might not. There's games where he's gonna play, but like he's not gonna start on that team. No. So the same starting five. Same starting five, but like like oh, I don't see him starting on that team, even when healthy. Because I, I think he's coming in at what playoff time. There's no rush for him to come back to the game. That's one thing I like. Like he doesn't have to. They don't need him. He's coming in a situation where they don't need him. Which is fire. Like mm. he hurt himself. It's not like a team is like, damn, we need him to get to the playoffs. They don't need him. So you respect that decision that they don't need. I him? do. I respect the his decision for going in because he's right right now. For the market's kind of more about the money. Nobody offered him anything. So and so he had to make his own decision. And his decision was smart because now you're guaranteeing coming off that injury. You're guaranteeing a ring. Not a ring, but you're guaranteeing finals type shit. You feel me? They're gonna play for the longest amount of time. Correct. So he's gonna be able to like play later in the year when he's more healthy. So and that's it. And that's scenario. It was a win win. It's a win for him. Definitely a win for him. I respect it. I just feel like them niggas is just overstacked over there. Like for sure. So that's why I'm saying Kawhi should join LeBron to you know somebody gotta fuck that package up, bro. I thought, because I heard Anthony Davis bought a crib in LA for like eight mil. Oh, so word? I thought he was sneaky about to fuck with um Braun and them, but Pelicans ain't letting go of him, bro. That's one of my top five players. What do you think about the Laker team? Like, like right this now, year, like all these funny additions, the Rondo, uh, the Michael Beasley. I respect Rondo. He's one of the my favorite point guards. Okay. He has like a great IQ of the basketball game, in my opinion, since the Celtics when he was playing with. Paul Pierce and um, you know Kevin Garnett. Like I always like this game. I feel like he knows the game. You feel what I'm saying? So I agree with that. I I you know Rondo to any team is a plus, but I also feel like Rondo lost himself once his team separated. You know the whole Ray Allen, Kevin Garnett, shit like that. I still think he's an above average point guard. He bouncing around the league because he he got hurt too for sure. I hope I don't think Rondo had an Achilles injuries. I hope not, but if he did, wasn't nothing major. He he's still solid. Uh, he's still solid. Opinion. Yeah, he's still more than solid. He can't shoot though. Who's gonna shoot on that team? I don't really need Rondo to shoot. But but, but just need him to. When you play with Braun, you got to space the floor and know that Braun's gonna do Braun. Okay, so now you got Rondo in the corner. I'm a, as a, I'm in the corner. Why he can't be? Where he's gonna be at? Braun got the Braun plays the point. Now, now in LA, Rondo should definitely play the point and open and up. And you got Bron spotted up. I'm uh, cheating off Bron, spot up shooter Bron. I'm cheating off that. I'm helping. Right. He he's not a shooter. They'll figure something out. That's I, Bron still got some sneaky moves to make. You know he's making his his his, his calls. You know that for a fact. He's been doing this for too long. Something Melo. Where Melo's going? From the looks of it, from the sources that I've been coming across, okay, it seems my son like got he's sources. Villa with the sources. <laughs> okay, we don't need tape. My son, she don't got no sources. My son Villa got sources. <laughs> I feel like my son going to the Rockets. Even though I think he should go to LA. But if I'm not mistaken, I think Lala got a business in LA. In LA, so it will make sense for him to go to LA. I like him in LA. I like him in LA too. I LA. like Melo and Braun makes sense to me. Melo. He did bad on KC. He did bad. That would be a nice. Melo. He did bad. Was terrible on OKC. Yeah, he did bad. That situation. I think Paul George personally didn't want to leave because he didn't want to break Westbrook's heart. I think that's why he leaves. He should have got out of it. OKC is fit. I like Paul George and um, Russell together. To to what? To play or to win? Like both. Win what, bro? I mean, they know. lost to what? Utah. Because they had now Utah's tough though. Yeah, but still first round. How do you Westbrook, mention Westbrook is out of it first how do you round? Mention, um, That's my favorite player. Who? Westbrook. Okay, favorite player. So you don't yeah. like him to win? I would like him to not win. This is just not looking realistic, bro. I'm a realist. Every Paul George is enough to do what? To entertain you? Oh, I, don't, I could be wrong. Him, Paul George, and Schroeder. From Atlanta Hawks, point guard. They traded Melo for Shooter, so now they got Shooter off the pond. What are we doing, bro? What are we? we what you think about Shooter? Just watching the game, or we? Nah, they're gonna be good, bro. Like good in, in what way? Not championship good, but they're gonna be good. Right. So what are we? What are Better we than last year. What are we doing, though? You think age is? 
shit is going up and up as the years go on, bro. There's fresh legs coming in, bro. Time's of the essence, bro. Nah, you're right. I so agree. what are we doing? Oh man, the Knicks. Uh, I'm switching on you fast. Huh? It's cool. Oh, we get into sports. I get hyped. Yeah, this is cool. So every time you say you said something. Well, hold on, hold on. Before you get to the Knicks, okay. talk to me about what are we really doing? Well, who? You talking about this Struder and Paul? George I like that. I like it. To do what? To do very well in the West. To. I like like all right. Your favorite player Westbrook, you said. So I really like him. He's not my favorite player. But I like I his aggressiveness. He's I just, like his character. His character. Way he breaks the game. Arr. Exactly, I like that. That's why I like him. I like Paul George. He defends, he shoots. He's a real good number two. I agree. Now, you probably need a third star. Probably, but maybe not. What are you like, doing, though? You still have yeah, like third star. What do you want to do? Max, what are we doing? Yeah, going to be good. That's what you're going to be. Like, you want me to put you in the spot? What's the conference? Yeah, the like, well, something, please. Cause yeah, top four. So they have a, uh, a solid, legit shot. They better than the Lakers. Right now. Yeah, with LeBron. Seven games with LeBron, they yeah, win. Yeah, they beating him. You put money on the board on that. I mean, I'm not a real gambling person unless I know for sure, but. You have no type of confidence in it. I got game. confidence. Nah. To pull the money up? Right, I'm going to remind you, fresh memory. Paul George took LeBron seven games, almost beat him. I remember. Now, you put Russell Westbrook on that same Indiana Pacers team. Who wins it? Who wins? What are we doing? Right. I, I, I see your, your point. Now you add Schroeder. I'm not saying Schroeder's super guard, but he's respectable. You know, I had him. I don't know if he played fantasy basketball, but I, no, play I, I fuck with the fantasy shit. Schroeder, got, he puts up numbers. He probably averaged like 20 and like 7 last year. I know year. nothing about him. He's, he's solid. Where is he from? He's Rondo. Where is he? He's Rondo. I mean, he's Rondo, but he can shoot a little bit. Like he's knocking down a shot. He's, he's knocking it down. Man. He's he's Rondo-ish. I got you. I got you. I got you. Oh. Mm.